What's up guys? It's Lizzie and we're back with the next session of Oxen Free and then it'll be dinner time for Moaz, so let's do this. Jesus, that house is huge. That lady really knew how to live. It's like the Chateau de Adler. Ah, oh, she does have a boat. Yeah, see? Allie knew what she was talking about. She should, anyway. I mean, she had to schlep back and forth here all summer. Schlep. What a weird word. So we have to... Oh, 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 what am I going over here for? Nah, 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 nah. The stairs are right here, you dumbass. Okay. Oh, oh, it's like a... It's like a boat that needs keys. There are no oars. And before we go crazy, it's not... It wasn't with Maggie's stuff back at the office, like with the radio? No, we checked everything. Huh. Well, uh... What's plan B if we can't find it? Um... The keys, they... They have to be in the house. For the movers or her family, you know? That's as good a guess as any. Alright, so now we're gonna be in either house. Sometimes when I lock myself out of my house, I'll just... I can't help but just stare at the deadbolt trying to, like, hypnotize it to open or something. You ever do that? Um, not really, but we can try that now if you think it'll help. No, I'm good. Alright, let's check the front door, but I'm gonna imagine that it's locked and we're gonna have to go through the basement and get the shit scared out of us again. It's a radio lock. Oh! The woman sure did love her antiquated security. Let's do this. Alright, we'll go this way first. Gotta go fast. Oh, there it is. Bam. That is a nifty gizmo. Whoa. Finally. Carissa, oh, God, Jesus. you scared me. Thought you were like Maggie Adler's dead body or something. How would that make sense? Clarissa, where have you been? After we saw you in town, you just- Hey, I could ask you the same thing. It was like I sneezed and you were gone. I ended up in the fields and just decided to come here and like wait it out. And how the I fuck did you get in here? Since. Oh, there so we go. I thought I'd camp it up. Uh, and then how'd you get past the gate? It's like a slab of wrought iron. It looked impossible to climb. Well, apparently it's not that impossible since, you know, I'm here. I thought you hated physical activity. Uh, not when my life's in peril. Christ. Look, Clarissa's is here. So everyone's here now. We can just everyone's okay, all right? That's a good thing. Yeah, let's just Find the keys to the boat, or a phone, or whatever, and just find a way home. I promise, we can all keep talking and or fighting at school on Monday. Yeah, fine. Okay, let's focus up. Everybody find something and hope that it helps. Alright. Phone first. Ah, <sighs> it's been disconnected. Bummer. Also, how did she get in the house? How are you doing? How are you doing? No, but how are you doing? I think about as bad as everybody else right now. I feel like I've been run over with a truck with uh, acid wheels. Where is everyone that going? Makes sense. Yeah, that's pretty much been the slogan of the night. We'll make shirts when we get home. We'll be okay. Man, she owned enough books. It's mostly math, I think. Ergodic thermodynamics. And religion, sheesh, there's okay, a lot of- Okay, we get it. She liked the smell of paper. Fascinating insight. We'll all miss her dearly. I'm not talking to you. I'm just talking out loud. You can only ever talk out loud. Ugh. God, she's a right cunt, that one. Wait, did I just not see my reflection in this mirror? Oh, okay, there, there it is. I was like, I was like, did I turn into a fucking vampire or some shit? Oh, I'm so creeped out by this house. Oh, that's an attic? Thought it was like a cat's toy or something. Wanna come up? Yeah, sure. The chest is padlocked. Needs a combination. Perfect. Mrs. Adler was either paranoid beyond belief or just This right here looks really familiar. Woman. Well, she buried information in sonically camouflaged containers, Jonas. My guess is paranoid. Come on, Jonas, don't get stuck up in the end. No. Not gonna look in the nightstand? Okay. 
Wait, have you seen this? It's like a, a star map or a diagram of planets or something. Yeah, why would she need anything like a map of the universe? I mean, it's not like she's bouncing stuff off satellites for a job. Or maybe they were back then, what do I know? Just for fun, I guess. I don't know, you have a NASA poster in your room, are you really gonna hop into a shuttle? Hey, I might one day, come on. Ooh, Nelly. Oh, it's a, it's a draft of her letter that she left in the office. To whom it should concern. She left notes everywhere, she said. Hidden with secret signals. She was an odd one, I'll give her that. But, you know, cool in a way. Maybe she was up to something, you ever think of that? I mean, she's wrapped up in this thing somehow. Maybe, but also things don't have to make sense. Sometimes stuff just happens, and that's the end of it. Looked at the phone. Alright, so we gotta find the combination for the uh, padlock. Put some clothes on! <laughs> Remember that guy? Where are your parents? You kids better get- Oh, um, Chad's lake house. Yeah, yeah, that guy was a friggin' weirdo. Uh, yeah. Well, they're being real helpful right now. Look at him. <laughs> There's something in here. Just looks like vacation slides or something. Find anything useful? Not yet, but you know... The night is young. How are you, um, how are you feeling? Like, physically? Everyone kind of looks like they have the flu. What do you care how I'm feeling? <gasps> like, seriously, why didn't you let me go with you to Main Street? Did I do something that bad? Well, you were being a total goober. What do you want me to say? I mean, a second brownie. You know that was dumb. And what did it affect? Nothing. I don't even know why I'm arguing with you. Just forget I said anything. Go about your business. Oh, no. Huh. Ren, you were right. There's, like, a ledger here. The Adler family does own the island. Never doubt me. And here's the combination for the... There's a, a padlock chest in the attic upstairs. 29, 18, 54. Uh, cool? I'm writing that down just in case. <laughs> she made a lot of... What should I call these? Slides? They're, they're not videos. Um... Silent memories? Oh, I thought it would let me put it in the projector. Alright, let's go open up the open up the chest. I should have just taken Nona with me, man. <laughs> like <laughs> uh, just let them duke Are it you, out. Um, doing okay? <sighs> yeah, I'm alright. Yeah? We're going home soon, so. Yeah, that's true. Y'all think you're going home anyway. I think the ghosties are gonna have a different idea. 29, 18, 54. All right, it's I a didn't. lot of radios and those containers we saw at the town office. Oh, and like a map of the caverns. She's written here tune into the source? What do you think that means? She couldn't have known about the ghosts, right? Tune into the source. It, it's probably something about the special radios, you know? Huh. Is this... Ah, the boat keys. Got him. Got him! Let's blow this pop stand. Oh, I just got that. Popsicle stand. It does make sense. That still doesn't make sense to me. Alright, we got keys for the boat. Where? Jonas found them in a chest upstairs. So, say thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. I was just saying it. It's not directed at you or anything. Okay. Oh, God. Oh. Alex. Oh, Alex. Come down here, please. We have something we want to show you. <laughs> I'm not... I'm not listening to this, all right? I'm not playing along anymore. Oh, just come down, and we'll drink to our future. <laughs> come down, okay? It'll be all right, I promise. <laughs> this is not Gucci. Here comes a candle to light you to bed. 
Here comes the sword to chop off your head. What? Ren, are you... are you alright? We're in a... we're in a time loop thing. Nona. Nona, come on, honey. It's time to motor. I gotta go to the basement, don't I? Oh, God. Come on, Jonas. I, I really need you. Don't blank out on me now. What? Where is she? Now we imagine you're a bit confused, but don't fret. This will be the final part of your training, Alex. Fuck you! All training is supervised by very skilled instructors. Training? I, I don't want to be trained. What are you signed up for this, Alexandra? possible. So please, I cannot bear your excuses, offspring. How was I meant to know what the hell was gonna happen? And yet, without, without understanding, understanding your footing, you still acted. Don't worry. worry. The test is easy. We will speak of something we see in the house, and you will go and find it. See? As simple and good humor as your mother's apple pie. I don't want to play this. Just tell me what's happening. Refusal to cooperate will incur grim penalties, I'm afraid, but it's your choice. Now, let's start with a softball. I spy, with my little eye, radiation. There is, of course, a time on the pier. So... What? Ten, nine, eight... Radiation? Six, five... Oh, I'm sorry, child. You weren't even close. Oh! <gasps> oh, no! Oh, look at that. The little one's up and hit her back! Now! Oh, I'm sorry, dear. What's done is done, as they say. If you paid attention, you'd have noticed the television set right by my side, the little X-ray emitting death machine. What right television now, set? Be wise to think of radiation. Sure, my other sense. Pay attention. What does this have to do with with us? I mean, we're. we're I not... spy with my little. Eyes. Okay, that's definitely <laughs> this. Ah! Let's make this a little harder, okay? Uh, is it the, the this painting? It, it looks kind of like a knot. Excellent, excellent. You're doing so well. It's time for the bonus round, Alex, so stay quick. This is what you'll really want to find. I spy with my little eye a picture of a memory. Be fast now. The, the, the mirror, right? Little ducks went out one day over the hills and far No. Mommy duck called quack, quack, quack. Picture of a memory. Three, two. No, 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 no. No little ducks can park in back. The, the picture of, of, I guess it's Maggie, Adler, and somebody. Is this it? Yes, very nice. That's Margaret Adler and her friend Emma. See, you and your schoolyard chums are experiencing, well, this has sort of happened before. Maggie and Emma tried to sport with us many years ago, and, well, only one survived. And in the process, we discovered a way for us to return, so to speak. It just takes a little time. And a far-reaching tolerance for the ignorance. Wait, what? What happened to Anna? Let's leave it at the poor girl didn't know what she was playing with. It doesn't matter. They're not an eternal recurrence. The waves. It's the waves, we think. And we will use the waves to absorb into your friends so as sunlight blooms into flowers. And we will grow. And we will engulf. You, you can't do that. Think about what you're doing. We can do that, Alex. And what has seemed to your parents as 80 years has been for us eons to know an existence without life. We tried it too quickly with Anna, but now we know to wait and soak. We had to keep you here on the island. It will be a great honor, Alex, really, to carry us through this life. And on to the next. You... you had your t You had your time. Don't take ours just because you had some... some accident. We never had our time. It was ripped from us. We watched the universe's conception fly to its demise over and over and over again. When our vessel dashed on the rocks, we had until dawn. And 
so are you. We would spend our time wisely. And we thank you for your good service. So, I'm kind of screwed. What the f fuck? Oh, 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 oh. I gotta... was horrid. I can't believe I killed Nona off like right at the beginning. And where is there a television next to her? I see a grandfather clock, an end table, and a chair. Oh no. Tell Michael he should go to school here. What does this what does this matter? He's dead. He's not he's not here. <sighs> That's not what I said, though. So we can go on. <laughs> I, I think I'm gonna be sick. Me first. Uh, it wasn't a dream or a vision or something. You and Clarissa standing in the living room just now, was it? Ah, uh, no. But I wish it was a dream. Usually there's a lot more talking horses. And look, Alex, if you're ever getting asked to find someone's crap, less ghosts are gonna punish, not you, ask to tag out or something, cause God, that felt like my skin was getting pulled off. Normally, she's good at this stuff. Normally. I'm sorry, all right? I, I tried my best. I mean, when things are jumping all around, it's tough to even know what she was talking about. So, I mean, Christ, if Clarissa was whisked away to the cave by nuclear submarine monsters, then... I mean, the plan has to be to retrieve her, right? No. I'm still going to call them ghosts, if that's okay. A ghost is a monster, so... I'm just not going to say anything. Yes, that would appear to be the, um, the plan. Well, if we're going to the cave... Oh, actually, I forgot. I saw the entrance has been caved in since you guys went inside. All right, I know there are a whole bunch of secret communist bomb-fearing tunnels dug into this place during the 1950s. And Maggie has loads of film about military stuff in her basement, so... Maybe there's a way back into the cave through one of those, you're thinking? <sighs> Let's take a look. Oh my god. What kind of name is a Fippany Fields anyway? Wait, is it a Fippany? It's, uh... It's a Piffany Field. Oh, that makes more sense. So I wonder why Clarissa was the easiest one for them to, to like take control of or whatever, if there's a reason behind that. Be careful, that film's really flammable. Wouldn't want Smoke and Johnny to light the house on fire. Ha ha. All right, there's already something in here. Experiments and findings of experienced phenomena, January 52. Awesome. Oh, man. If this turns out to be just prehistoric home videos... Yeah. I'm sure this is just the, uh... God, it's just the first thing. Just give it a second to warm up, will you? You can, uh, skip... Okay, we're getting warmer, I think. So, if you look at the, like, lines or whatever, the bomb shelter should lead right into the cave. Just like from another angle. According to this, at least. Oh, so it does. But won't it be, like, locked or something, right? Yeah, how do we get in? It's just like the cave wall, only steel or whatever bomb shelters are made out of. Oh, what? She knew about these things? Wow, that's crazy. It says that to fix a temporal tear, that's a mouthful, in the cave, we would need to transpose to the other side and tune into the source within itself. Okay, but we're not doing that, right? Good question. Yeah, that's... That's going a little above. Above and beyond. Well, how would she even know this? I don't care how much research she did, this would be out of anyone's realm of expertise. Well, something better work, or... Or we're boned. Or we're boned. Precisely. Oh, sorry, this is like... This looks like the end, but from the... From the wrong film thing. 
No, 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 wait. This is something I actually remember from that stupid radio tour thing because it, like, sounded so weird. It's called the call and response system. It unlocks the bomb shelter. This is showing us how to do it. See, it says when someone sends an emergency signal from the Capard station in the woods and the receiving station confirms it. It's like a connected response thing. All right, but come on, Nona, do you honestly believe that the old equipment in either building will still work? It's, I don't know, but it's the only thing we have so far. And time's a-clickin'. Alex and me will head through the woods, do the, um, call part. You and Ren can hang by the door to the bomb shelter and open it when it's ready. Oh, I, okay, I tried to say something, but I couldn't say anything. So now I have to, oh god, I have to go all the way back up to the fucking, uh, unbelievable. Adler numbers, station 140 point. So, but it hasn't said anything else except for to turn the, turn the light on. All right, break. And if anything goes wrong, please, don't tell me. I won't want to know. Same here. I don't want to know nothing. All right, let's boogie. But it looked like there had to be like a... Oh, I guess... Um, yeah, it looked like you had to hit it from two different directions to get the bomb shelter to open. So now I'm confused. Ooh, ooh, what's down here? Excuse me. Oh, that's to the beach. We don't need to go to the beach. Eh, eh, eh. Come on. Okay. Oh, I just smacked my headphones. Sorry if y'all heard that. Hello? Hello? Okay, there we go. My stomach hurts. That was just spoop level 9,000. <laughs> okay. So, where do we need to go? Um, we need to go up. Oh shit. Oh shit. Alex. Alex, okay. Are you are you back to normal? I just saw, it, it, it was like a premonition, I think. And, and I know that sounds whatever, but this must be what it's like when people say they do that, because I kind of just saw Ren drowning. Okay, okay, just take it easy for a second. You went all red-eyed, like when we get possessed. I did? You stopped walking and started mumbling, and then your eyes lit up like little road flares. It only lasted like a minute, but we should hurry up and do this before the door on you opens any wider than. The thing with Ren, it was so real. It was like it, I was there with him. Maybe we should go back. But I'm sure he's fine, so let's finish what we started. Nope, where's Ren? We're gonna go check on Ren. Wait, where did they go? Where were they planning on going? Where were they going? Why aren't they on my map? Me no likey. So do I even have the option to go and see if he's alright? And what would be the point in them killing him anyway? Because they need him to be alive if they're going to try and possess our bodies. Or what have you. They should be right here. This is the bomb shelter, right? So where the fuck did they go? <laughs> no, look, it kind of made sense. 
Hey, guys. Uh, wait. Did I get the plan wrong? Because if I got it right... No, you didn't get it wrong. We're just taking this way, that's all. What? The scenic route? Everything's the scenic route. There's no quicker way. Uh, okay. Well, we'll be here. Good luck. Okay. Yeah, let's not just say that we just saw him drowning, because I'd be like, you're fucking crazy! Alright, where am I going? Where oh, I hit space instead of... Yeah, we gotta go to the woods and then to the bridge stand, right? I think. I don't know. I'm lost. To wee woods! Oh, whoops. Space. I got my controls all mixed up. I keep wanting to hit control now to make shit happen you instead of- You know what time of... it is? It's four in the morning. Which is usually about the time everyone decides if they're going to bed or ordering another three pizzas. Yeah? What's your vote usually? In, uh, that situation. Uh, never leave pizza on the table. It's like getting 11 in blackjack. Just double down. Hang on, are we going? Yeah, we're good. Don't even think about it. You think this tuning into the tear thing's gonna work? Like, really? It really doesn't matter if I think it's gonna work. It's sort of all we have, and we're running out of time. It Why is all we have, yeah. I just, I just wish I felt like the ghosts were concerned that their plan won't work. I just feel like they're pretty confident. Like they know by sunrise they're all going to be shopping for school supplies. Yeah, well, you know who else was confident? Hitler. And look how he ended up. Dead. With syphilis. Oh, true. I think that this um, stuff is getting pulled in from, like, their time or something. This is so weird. Um, yeah, it's not exactly a good omen. I think we're running out of runway here. Yeah, just a little bit. Wait, am I going the right... I hope I'm going the right way. Oh, go! Okay. Yes, this is where we want to go. I just wonder if there is like an actual time limit. Like if I had been, you know, if I had decided to just run around. No, what time is dawn? I guess six? Is this where... What's their faces? Now the station's up at the top of the hill. I hope this works. Is this where they got the idea for Until Dawn? Top of the hill, top of the hill, top of the hill, top of the hill. Hello, thank you. <laughs> the fuck? Now the station's up at the top of the Oh hill. no 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 no. <sighs> God, we're in another loop de loo. They always come at the most appropriate times, don't they? <sighs> yeah, they do. Thanks for the update. Why is she the only one who realizes that they're in a loop? Now the station's up at the top of the hill. I hope this works. Yep, I am also Hope that. No, he didn't say it that time. Am I supposed to go a different direction? 
Yeah, I think I'm supposed to go a different direction. Let's try going down again. Oh, giblets. Ren! No, no, what happened? What's wrong with Ren? Ren, he's... He had an accident. He... He died. I couldn't... How? I, I mean, yeah, we just saw you. How, how did this happen? He... He drowned. He took a fall. What? I don't know. He just... He just stopped. I mean, does it really matter what happened? Either way, done is done. And done. No, you're not Jonas, so there's no use in pretending. Soon it won't be a pretense. It'll be an absolute. Alex, we know you're in charge, and we know your plan, and we also know that your plan won't work. It never does. So we have a proposition for you. A deal. A bargain, really. Um, a proposition? Like, like what? It's already over for Clarissa. She's gone. We'll pilot her through the rest of existence, and there's nothing you can do to change that. But, if you agree to let us take her, let her go, quietly, without fuss, you won't slaughter the rest of your friends. Like young Reginald here. We leave the rest of you cattle alone. We only really need the one, anyway. I don't, I don't get it. Why do you even need my permission if you have her already? Don't misunderstand. We don't need anything from you except what we can willingly take. We're merely offering you an arrangement that would leave both parties satisfied. Well, somewhat satisfied. Your friends would be fine. And you're not... Forget it. No deal. Everyone is coming home with me. <sighs> Courage is not always the way, dear. Yeah, you can fuck you don't off. Have much time left. Do you know how we know you don't have much time left? We're getting out of here. All of us. Run too. <laughs> okay. We know because we can be Jonas for this long, and his soul is as quiet as an empty church. Just never say we didn't provide you all the rules. Where's Jonas? Let me go check the building. Hang on. So I wonder what would have happened if I was just like, yeah, fuck yeah, take Clarissa. Fuck that bitch. Because I wanted to. I was sorely, sorely tempted to say it. Oh, okay, here we go. your best friend Alex I I'm sorry I don't I don't know what happened one minute he was there and then he was just it's okay no no you you didn't do anything wrong I know it's not your fault of course it's not your fault I didn't know him that well but I like what I'd gotten to know he's not I'm dead sorry. it's I shouldn't it's colossally stupid of me to talk about him like that with you here this is he was more important no, not really. Ren would be flattered to hear you say anything about him, so if he can hear this at all, trust me, he's over the moon right now. Sure. It's a tiny thing, but I hope he knew that I liked him. And I don't know if he did. He hopes you did. I think that's enough. Like I said, it's a tiny thing. The station's up at the top of the... Ugh. God. That was... My mouth feels like I just... ate a... tree. You were possessed. And for the longest time, I think that we've, um... seen so far. Yeah, I know. I can... kind of remember that part. Hello? Anyone there? What? Are they... 
Oh, they're, um, they're somehow... I guess they're somehow broadcasting or something from the, uh, station speakers. <laughs> Are you guys at the station? They're both alive. Anybody? That's all I care about. Jonas? God. Yeah, Jonas? no, that's a, Punch that's a bonus too. Punch me, Seriously? why? Right in the throat. Jonas, don't listen. We're all set here for the, uh, the thing? The machinery's beacon hug or whatever we're doing? Yeah, let's do it. Time's wasted. Right, radio locked. Like, I actually wasted. Like, I feel my body wasted away. Okay, I just no, have to tune it. No, it's okay if you're, like, dealing with stuff. We had to deal with stuff. What stuff? The, uh, when I almost kind of slipped and fell off the bridge. Oh my god, you guys, that... No, it was the... It was psychotic to watch. Like, almost doesn't quite describe the terror that held my heart watching her come close to... It wasn't that. You were perilously close to tumbling into the ocean from like 5,000 feet up. It wasn't that high. And give them to... It was Bob. like... Romeo. It was high. Alpha. Believe me. Victor. No, Echo. it wasn't. Athena. Yeah, it was. No. It... Ugh, just lose whatever. Their name. I'm fine. People and lose their fine. names and it's give them to graves? Romeo. Okay, just... Whenever you're ready, because I'm sure you're listening. Yeah, just hit the button, the receiver thing, and we can do this stuff. Stuff, exactly. <laughs> okay, over. Over now. Why do you have to have the last word? Over is good enough. Over now. Come on. One of these days. There we go. Bam. Like a boss. Hello. We're here. We made it. Hello. Oh, hello. This is Edward Island's emergency. How may I help you? If you're being sat on by a very large burglar, just mash the dial with your fist, please. It is so nice to hear you two finding the sunny side of all this. We are. Well, he is. We both are. Don't let her fool you. Signal verified. Shelter TF1 open. Nice. I guess it worked. Great. Okay, we'll meet you there. Right. See you at the shelter. Over and out. Close the time hole and save the day. On it, boss! Let's go. Oh, my ear itches. Oh. Ow. Eh. You would think I'm just wondering like why it was so easy for Clarissa to be possessed because you would think that as you, what's the word I'm looking for here not bitchy but I mean she is Oh, no, this way. But as, as dominant of a personality as she has, that she wouldn't be so easily taken over, you know? How long have I been recording? 39 minutes-ish. So this seems like a good time to take a break. Doink. All right, so we're going to end it here <clears throat> for the time being so I can render these videos and get this shit uploaded because I can't render and play the game at the same time or my computer goes kaput. So this was interesting to say the least. There's a lot to unpack here and I kind of just want to throw the entire suitcase away. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video and this session of Oxenfree and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!